when the players come back um, after the holiday, we, we assess them, we see where they are um, in terms of the strength and the power capabilities together with a, you know, a physical and physiological screen, together with the physios. You don't come back from, from, uh, from vacation completely out of fitness, you've been doing uh, a lot of work yourself, but you're still a bit worried about how you are compared to the other ones. 선수 정신적으로나 육체적으로 상당히 다 이제 릴렉스한 상태에서 다시 또 돌아와서 훈련을 해야 되겠죠. 그런 부분에서 정말 스위치 온을 해야 되는 부분이 가장 힘들고. Obviously we want the players right for day one, which is why we've got to push the guys a little bit harder. We feel that we have to do that a to get a good start to the season, but also to to build up a, a general tolerance to training. I well, always have a work with with Tony. What sort of thing? What sort of load we gonna we we can give them? For me, it's more tactical, tactical. For Tony's team, it's more making sure that they hit the right sort of intensity. They son so I agarras las bases en todo el aspecto, la lo físico, en lo técnico, en todo, no. Empiezas a conocer jugadores, pueden llegar jugadores nuevos o no, y para eso sirve, no, para irlos conociendo, para ir trabajando con todos ellos y bueno, irnos acoplando poco a poco para para iniciar muy bien la temporada. It's a time to to get acquainted off the pitch as well as on the pitch and to get in sync with each other, talking and understanding and getting your bearings back again on where to be on the pitch in pre-season is vital. If you want to win something, if you really want to win something that season, you have to walk out. You have sometimes some player vomit, you know, in the prison. I, I, I vomit sometimes. But because I know, I know I'm going to get the result in the season, you know, maybe the last five games, maybe the last five games when everyone's going to be tired. Maybe Manchester will still be strong and still have to desire and that spirit to, to win everything.